It is a Templar matter, and we will be handling it. Seems like you Templars could use all the help you can get. True. It is surely not in the lad's best interests to turn away anyone who seeks to find him. There is a Templar, a former Templar, by the name of Samson. He left the Order due to philosophical differences. He has been known to help mages flee Kirkwall. If Enriel went to him, Samson wouldn't tell me. He lays out of sight by day, but I've seen him at night, near the entrance to Darktown. Ah, okay. Uh, we gotta talk to this lot over here. More mages. You talk. I'm going to ask the guards about their training. I know your face. I am Tobras. You and that man are both hawks. I remember your father. Malcolm was a good man. My father must have left quite an impression. The letter I found was ancient. I needn't tell his own child how special he was. As to the letter, it pained me to send news of the Templar's death. The Templar? He allowed your father to leave Kirkwall. Rule is not served by caging the best of us. A wise man. Sounds like he didn't quite understand the job. Doubt can serve the faithful, even as it vexes them. I fear this has been lost. I will send the letters I held. It seems fitting that they return to family. Can you just give them to me? Piece of shit. Such a friendship. Few like your father remain. Even fewer like the Templar. Rest well at the Maker's side. Sir Morivar Carver. Nice. Very nice. Anyway. Let's see what we can do over here. Ah, welcome, my dear friend, to Sol's shop. My name is Solifitus. Please take a look around. My apologies in advance. Our shelves are a bit bare at the moment. Hey, if you're interested, I could use a bit of help to remedy that. Remedy that? Potion shop. You, my good man, are priceless. The pun wasn't intentional, although I may use that next time. It's been too dangerous to leave the city of late, and the substances I require for my creations are, of course, elsewhere. Perhaps you could find them. You'll be compensated for your time, have no fear. I'll also give you first pick on my new creations. Make up a list of what you need and I'll keep an eye out for you. Perfect. A discount on everything in the shop, Sirrah. The first uh, enchanter does not wish me to sell merchandise. Uh, why don't you shut up? Anyway. Let's get out of here. And then... Do we want to go down there? Do we want to go there? Ah, let's go there first. There we go. Ho, oh, Lord Carver. We're a long way from cowing Templars with our titles, brother. You could slap on a smile for a few days, for her sake. She's interested in what I think. She will provide for us, and you're making sure it happens. And when we're done, I don't know. I guess we'll sit around thinking about how great we used to be. Mother didn't even want that life back until we got dumped here. You only care because we're under Templar scrutiny. You hating everything I do is really losing its charm. Sure, make light. Why take anything seriously? You're the eldest. You lead by default. I don't see you taking the reins. 
When should I do that? When I'm following you around, or, or when I'm caring for Mother while you tame mighty Kirkwall? Besides, we both know what happens when someone leaves dear brother's protection. I'm sure Bethany would appreciate that you're keeping good humor. Fun's fun, but you're taking this little pissing match too far. What? You don't like someone making a joke out of everything you are? I don't see the humor in digging up Bethany so you can hide behind her, too. Well, good talk. Might have been a little Brother. harsh. I feel... I don't know. It's like Mother taking everything out on us. She was just scared. I don't have a place in the life she is trying to bring back. I'm here if you need me. I must find my own way. Uh, good luck with that. Can we really... Here, I got something. Why? I'm not holding you back with generosity. Just have a look. These are by father. Are you sure they aren't meant for you? I bet another mage could get more out of them. For your service that cannot be admitted, I ask that you accept this trinket and know that I shall respect your name. Thank you, Conscience of the Order, Sir Moravar Carver. Carver? The Templar who allowed Father to leave Kirkwall. Your namesake. A Templar? We met a Templar who isn't a colossal prig. Well, there you go then. I wonder how it compares to yours. I know someone thought far too long about my name. It is. This was a swordsman. A man who let him look ahead. It would all mean still thoughtfully applied. Not exactly master of all blades, but Father actually thought there was worth to a swordsman. Thank you, brother. It's a connection I didn't think was there. Yeah, yeah, you're welcome, blah, blah, blah. And so we go. Yeah. Ah, oh, crap. I forgot to check my mail. We can do that later. We can definitely do that later. Girls. Oh, I'm an elf. Right. I can hear a lot. But in being cooped up with gambling. A little something of yours I picked up somewhere. You have done a great kindness in returning this. Ah, uh, whatever. Uh, let's see then if we check out attributes first. We are now at level 6, which means that, another page here, at level 6 I am supposed, alright, I am not paying attention here, level 6, constitution, I'm going to confirm that, and as for abilities, we want level six. Um, crushing prison, which would be this. Ah, then we also get stunning blast first. We're, we're set back one level, but um, it's because I didn't pay attention when writing down all this crap. So yeah, um, we're gonna go this way.
see if we can